Over the weekend, a KMT lawmaker raised a sensitive question. Should the KMT change its Chinese language name? KMT legislator Lin Weizhou said that the word Zongguo, which means China, should be removed from the name because they create confusion on what the party stands for. Reactions to his question are now coming in from across party ranks. Let's see what they're saying. KMT caucus whip and chief of its policy committee, Lin, put it out there on Facebook. What if the KMT changed its Chinese name by removing the words Zhongguo, which means China? The proposal is meeting stiff opposition from within. This is not an issue listed on the party reform agenda, so there is no need to discuss it. There is no way the committee can handle such a big issue tossed out like this with no prior notice. Would deleting those words convince young people to give you their vote? I'll be frank, I don't believe it would. Of course it should not be done. I firmly oppose it, now and for the rest of time. It is the history of the KMT. It's a chorus of opposition from lawmakers and a former president. KMT chairman Johnny Chang took to the front line with the party's official view. Changing our name is not an item on a list of reforms. The greatest consensus within our party is most likely that we need to exercise oversight over the DPP. You get pinned with a scarlet letter. They call you a Chinese party. So do we need a new name? Let's all discuss it. I raised the topic for discussion. We believe we should change China to Republic of China. Why not use Republic of China? It would eliminate misunderstandings. Lin moved to put out the fire on Monday as the issue threatened to widen party divisions. One KMT councillor in Tainan said he's in favour of a name change. We often draw too close to China, so how can we give people a good impression of the KMT? I agree with Lin Weizhou's idea of removing the two words that mean China. It's an internal reckoning that's once more spilled into public view. Over the course of its history, the KMT has changed its name several times. In recent years, its election losses have invariably been followed by calls for a new name. Former President Li Denghui once proposed that former legislative speaker Wang Jingping create a separate party altogether called the Taiwan KMT. Now in 2020, legislator Lin has brought back the question of a name change. But judging by the reactions within the party, the likelihood of progress on the issue seems slim.